Okay, hello, you doing? My name is William, and today I'm going to read another part of the Bible. Today I'm going to read Exodus chapter 12. Okay? Okay, I'll read it right now. Okay? Then the Lord spake unto Moses and Aaron in the land of Egypt, saying, This month shall be unto you beginning uh, the beginning of months. It shall be the first month of the year to you. Speak ye, the country of Israel, saying, In the tenth day of this month they shall be taken... The, the, the every man of the lamb, according to the house of their fathers, and the lamb of the house. Of the household of two little from the lamb, and let him and his neighbor next to his house, according to the number of the souls. Every man according to eating as shall make their your count of the lamb. Okay, your lamb is without blemish, a male of the first year. Ye shall take it out from the sheep, from the goats. And ye shall keep it until the fourth day of the same month. And when the Sunday congregation of the, of the Israel shall kill it in the, in the evening. And ye shall take it of the blood. And take it at the two side posts, on the upper door posts of the houses, where they shall eat it. And they shall eat it the flesh in the night, and the rolls with fire, and leavened bread, and the better herbs, so they shall eat it. Eat it, eat, but not of it raw, not sodden with water, but rolls with fire, and his head with legs, and with the penitence thereof. And they shall let nothing of it remain until the morning. And that which rings, it shall burn with fire. And then thou shalt eat of it, the loyals girded, your shoes, your feet, and your staff, and your hand. And you shall eat of in haste, in your Lord's Passover. For I will pass through the land of Egypt this night, and I will... Smite all the firstborn in the land of Egypt, both man and beast, against and against all the gods of Egypt, and I, and I will execute judgment. I am the Lord. For the blood I shall be to you, and for taking upon the houses where you are, and when I, and where and I see the blood, I pass over you, and I plague shall be upon you, and to destroy you and when I smite upon the land of Egypt. And, and this day shall be unto you for a memorial, and ye shall keep it a feast of the Lord throughout your generations. Ye shall keep it a feast of the ordinance uh, forever. Okay, seven days shall you eat unleavened bread, and even the first day shall put away leaven out of your houses. For whosoever eateth leaveth bread for the first day until the seventh day, that soul should be cut off from Israel. Um, and the first day shall be on a holy congregation. On, on the seventh day it shall be a holy congregation to you. No manner of work shall be done in them, so that which every man must eat only be done of you, and you shall uh, and me and you shall observe the feast of the unleavened bread for this self same day that I brought the armies out of the land of Egypt. Therefore shall ye observe this day, and our generations shall be my own ordinance forever. And this is the first month of the fourteenth day. 
on the month of even, you shall eat eleven bread until the one of twentieth day of the month of even. Seven days shall be no leaven found in your houses. For whosoever eateth, which is leavened, and even your soul shall be cut off at the congregation of Israel, whatever it be, he be a stronger born in the land. Come on, I think I'm gonna come on, move move for me. Move back up. On number No, that's too far up. Come on, I wanna go back to fifteen. Come on. Move! Move please! I wanna go back to fifteen. Come on. Okay, seven days I shall eat eleven bread. Even the first day shall leaven out of your house. So that's where eateth eleven bread. On the first day of seven days, that soul shall be cut off of Israel. And even the first day shall be of the holy convocation. And in the seventh day, there shall be no holy convocation to you. No, many reworks shall be done in them. Save it, so which every man must eat it. I mean, done with you. And you shall also the feast of the other bread for this self saving day, the part of the armies of the land of Egypt. Therefore, also the generations of the ordinance forever. In the first month of the fourteenth day of the month of even, you shall eat unleavened bread until the month, the twentieth day of the month of even. Seven days there shall be no leaven to found of your houses. For whatsoever eateth which is leavened, even then shall be cut off the congregation of Israel, whether it be the stranger or of the land. And ye shall eat nothing leavened, and your habitation shall ye eat a leavened bread. Huh? And Moses, for all the elders of Israel, said unto them, Come and, and take your lamb according to families. And kill it the Passover. And he shall take the bunch of, of Aesop and dip in the blood, and that is in basin, and the second of lentil, and the two side posts with the blood of it is in basin. And then shall they go out of the door of the house until morning. O Lord, I will pass through the smite of the Egyptians, and I will see with the Lord upon the intel. On the two side poles, the Lord, the Passover door, in order to destroy you, and whoever is coming up the houses to smite you. And we shall observe that this thing will be yours to thee, the signs forever. Okay, and it shall come to pass when you rekindle the land of which the Lord I gave you, according to the healthy promise, he shall keep the surface. And it shall, and it shall come to pass when you turn to say unto you, you may make the surface. And you may say the sacrifice of the Lord Passover. Pass the houses of Israel in Egypt. And it's both the Egyptians to deliver houses. And they bowed to the land of, and worshipped. Mm. 
excuse me. Bless me. Yeah, I know. Sorry, the sneezing. Let's keep reading now. And the children of Israel went away and did as they did with the Lord, and commanded Moses and Aaron, so did they. And it came to pass at midnight, and the Lord smote the firstborn of the land of Egypt, and the firstborn of Pharaoh, so that sat in the throne and the, into the firstborn of captive, that was in the dungeon, and the firstborn of cattle. And Pharaoh rose up in the night, and the and all the servants, and all the Egyptians, and the great in the great cry in Egypt, for there was not a house, and there was not one dead. And then he called him to Moses by Aaron by night, and he said, Rise up. And he get forth among my people, and both ye and children of Israel, and go to the Lord, and he said, Also, take your flocks and your herds, and he said, And be gone, and bless me also. And the Egyptians told our children of thy people, and they sent them in the land of haste, and they said, We'll be all dead men. And people took the dough before, and left it in there, near the rods of being bought up in their clothes upon their shoulders. And the children of Israel did according to the word of Moses. They devoured the Egyptians about silver, jewels, and raiment. And the Lord gave people favor sight of the Egyptians, and such things are acquired as well from the Egyptians. And the Lord judged Israel from races to squad, the, the 600 on, the, on foot of men beside children, and mixed small to throughout them, and flocks of herds, and men, much cattle, and baked eleven cakes, and the dough which they brought forth of Asia, it was not leavened because they were just out of Egypt. They cannot, they cannot tarry, neither they put themselves in effectual. Okay. Now they saw joining the journey of Israel, who dwelt in Egypt for 430 years. And it came to pass at the end of the 430 years, in the self same day of the gain of pass, and of the host and the Lord went out of the land of Egypt. It is the night of the observed the Lord bringing from out of the land of Egypt. This is the night of the Lord to be observed of the children of Israel in their generations. And the Lord said to Moses there, and this is the ordinance of Passover. Shall be no stranger to eat thereof. And the men servants brought them for money, and when thou hast circus of them, that shall be eat thereof. And for Rainer, and be the servants and shall not eat thereof. And the house shall be shall be eaten, and thou shalt carry forth aught of the flesh brought out of the house, neither there shall be break bone thereof. Okay. Okay. Okay, the congregation of Israel shall keep it. And when a stranger shall so join with thee, and I will keep the Passover to the, to the Lord, and his males be circumcised, and then let him near and keep it. And he shall be as one that is born in the land, and no, circum and no uncircumcised upon this shall eat thereof. One law shall be to him, and that is homeborn unto the stranger, the children among you. And thus did the children of Israel, and as the Lord commanded to Moses and Aaron, so did they. And it came to pass on the self same day, and the Lord did bring the children of Israel and all of Egypt by their armies. Okay, and then it's the ending of Exodus chapter 12. Okay, next video read Exodus chapter 13, okay?
Come on. Move, I want to put this on my favorites. Okay, now, save. Okay, the next video, read Exodus chapter 13, okay? Okay. Well, okay. well, I have to go right now, but thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you later. Bye. Oh, come on. Instead, move.